that you should change your mind, oh God. You are the God who honors your word, oh God. We want to say thank you for your presence that is in this place, oh God. We want to say thank you, oh King of glory, because you are with us, oh God. And we thank you because you are for us and not against us, oh God. My Father coming into your presence, oh God. It's not a waste of time, but in invested time oh god we thank you because our lives will never be the same again thank you for the lives that you are about to heal this morning oh god thank you for the hearts that you are about to touch oh god thank you for your freedom upon your children this morning oh god thank you for the comfort oh god thank you for the word that you want to minister to that broken heart this morning oh god thank you for the joy that you want to give that child who is in sorrow this moment, oh God. Thank you because people today are living better and stronger than they came in, oh God. Thank you because that person who came, oh God, just to pass time, oh my Father, they will have an encounter with you today, oh God, and they will know, oh God, that you love them, oh God. If they are lonely, oh God, thank you because, oh God, they are, they will be encouraged, oh God, and they will Go back, O King of glory, better than they came in, O God. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for your presence is in this place, O God. We welcome you, O God. We worship you, O God. We honor you, O God. Thank you for who you are, O God. There is none like you, O God. Thank you for the battles that you are fighting this moment, O God. You are the mighty warrior, O God. is your name Jehovah is your name Jehovah is your name Jehovah
are happy to be in the house of the Lord. Let me tell you, you your life will never be the same again. Tell your neighbor your life will never be the same again. Tell the other one your life will never be the same again. Amen. Let's clap our hands to Jesus because there is no one like him. happy to be in the presence of the Lord. Do we have expectant hearts to receive from God? So we want to declare this morning that he reigns in our lives. Amen. He reigns in our situations above every other thing in this world, in our families. He reigns. Hallelujah. Clap your hands to Jesus. Hey 
with your presence, oh God. And this morning we exalt you, oh God, and we call you easy. We Thank call you, oh God. Thank you, Jesus. You are worthy of our praise, oh God. Easy, you are worthy of a praise. Master, Master, 
of the Lord. You are the one who is the ancient of days. Isaiah saw the heavens opened and he saw the king, the Lord Almighty, and he was completely broken. There was rejoicing and lifting of the name of God in heaven by the cherubim in revelation the 24 elders put down their crowns and worship you this morning lord we worship you this morning we lift your name on high this morning we call you holy this morning we call you righteous this morning we call you the righteous one of israel the ancient of days you call yourself Jehovah. You are Yahweh. You are the beginning and the end. You are the Alpha and the Omega. You are the first and the last. You are the one that came to take away the power of death from the one who held the power of death. Who is the devil? Your blood speaks of better things than the blood of Abel. You are our healer. You are Jehovah Rapha. You are the bomb of Gilead. You are Jehovah Jireh, the God that provides for us. You are Shalom, the Lord, our peace. You are everything we ever needed. You need peace, he is shalom. You need provision, he is jailer. He is the one who opens the mind that you understand the scriptures. He didn't leave you as orphans. He gave us the Holy Spirit who stays with us. He convicts you of sin, righteousness, and judgment. He leads you in paths of righteousness for your great name's sake. He is the Holy One of Israel. Anybody here worship the Lord? His presence is in this place. He is righteous. He is holy. He is worthy. He is mighty. He is the one who has the power to life and death. He is sovereign. He is immutable. He is the never changing God. He is omniscient. He is omnipotent. He is omnipresent. He is the first and the last. The first and the last. He says he is in your midst. We bless you, Jesus. We ask that you forgive us of our iniquities, Lord. We have gone wayward. We have fallen short of your glory. And we thank you for the living sacrifice of Jesus. Our sins are forgiven. We are made holy because Jesus is our atoning sacrifice. 
the propitiation for our sins. He is the one who stands before the Lord and God sees the blood.